Hello, hello. Hello, welcome, welcome aboard. Can you guys hear me okay? Thumbs up. Yes. yes. I can hear you. Nice, nice, nice. I can hear you. Fantastic to hear. We're going to wait a minute or two to see who else joins in. And then we start. Buena, buenas, welcome. Everybody who's coming in, welcome, welcome. Welcome everybody, welcome to class. Hello, hello. Welcome teacher. Good evening, everybody. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Welcome, welcome. Good evening, mister. Hello, hello. Good evening. Good evening, good evening. Can you hear me? Oh, yes, yes, we can. Loud and clear, sir. Hello, hello. How's everybody doing? Thumbs up, thumbs down. Thumbs up. All right. Nice, nice, nice to see the thumbs up. Nice. All right. I am going to start. And we are course Inglés Pre Avanzado Modulo Numero Tres. From what I have seen, pre advanced one, two, and three are advanced, but I still like to ask. How would you like this class to continue? Let me go ahead and put it in the chat and you guys choose, right? I am going to put 100% English. I am going to put 75% English, which means that the, the, the remainder will be Spanish. I am gonna say 50%. So ahí estaba, michi micha, 50-50. And it's more like Spanglish. Now, Spanglish is good, but at the same time is a little bit bad, right? Because we get used to it. And when we're having a normal conversation, we, we want to do Spanglish. And, and so it, sometimes it doesn't work out too well. So we have, we have one for 100% English. Okay, all right. Does everybody feel that way? 100% English? Thumbs up, thumbs down. Yes, sir. Thumb in the middle. Oh, it's better. It's better? Okay. Yeah. Now, something that we can do is we can do 100% English. And if there's something that you guys need to reinforce in Spanish, please let me know. And what I can do is I can quickly cover it in Spanish and in English. And then that way you have an idea, right? Or uh, I'm sorry, a better idea of what was just explained. Would you guys like that? 
Is that something that works for you guys? Yeah. All yes, right. Okay. Yes. Yes. Okay. All right. Fantastic. Fantastic to hear. Welcome. Welcome. So let me let me see the names that I have on here. I have Max. Hello, Max. Can you hear me? Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. I have Ho here. Jose, Joe, Joe Mejia, Jose Mejia. Got it, sir. Okay. Tengo Daniela Guevara. Hello. Ni Hello, hello. Nin, Ninive. Ninive. Is that how you, am yes. I saying it? Is that, how, I'm saying it okay? Ninive? Yes, Ninive. Ninive. Okay, got it. Josue. <laughs> Josue, I got Josue. Tengo a hello. Iris. Hello, hello, Josue. Iris, hello. How you doing, Iris? Hello. I have Luis Hi. Enrique. Bien, bien, de nove, bien de novela, Luis Enrique. Hola, ¿cómo me llamo Luis Enrique? <laughs> yes. All right, welcome aboard. You're right. Dennis, hello. Hello, Dennis. Hi. How's it going, sir? Nice to hear you. Nice to see you. David, how you doing, sir? Nice to meet hello. you. Welcome aboard. All right, excellent. So le let me start off. Um, I know that the name that appears on here is Inglés Corporativo for me. Now, that's not my name. Um, I have a real name. They ask us not to change it. My real name is Roberto, Robert, Roberto, Roberto Martinez. <laughs> el teacher, el teacher, Roberto Martinez. Pueden decirme master, como ustedes quieran, ¿verdad? Yo soy humilde, acepto, <laughs> acepto cualquier cosa. Eh, okay. un poco acerca de mí y vamos a hablar acerca de eso porque les voy a pedir también the same type of information a little bit about me I have been teaching for a long time I have been teaching for a little bit over 15 years so yes I look young but I am not I am older than what you could possibly imagine um How old am I? Well, I remember when I was a kid that in order to change the channel on my TV, I had to click and turn a knob and it would go clack, 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 clack. And there was only <laughs> about eight channels. That's how old I am, even though I don't look it. Thank you very much. White and black ice cream. Teacher. Black and white, yeah, <laughs> black and white ice cream. And, uh, you know, something that I remember growing up was that my grandma used to watch novelas. And there was one specific novela que se llamaba Cuna de Lobos. And I remember oh. that very, very, you know, because of, because of my grandma. So, Roberto Martinez, 15 years teaching. Rafael Monge, welcome, sir. Welcome aboard. I see here that we have Juan Hi. Manuel. How you doing? How you doing? Juan Manuel, we got Juan Manuel. You? Good, good. Thank you very much. Welcome aboard. Welcome to class. Okay. The next one. Where did I or where have I been teaching these past 15 years? Well, I was teaching English at a call center called, now it's called Converges. But I worked there when it was called Dell. I worked there when it was called Stream. I worked there when it was called Concentrix. So if you guys remember any of these names, please let me know. Do you guys remember okay. Dell? Yeah. Dell, yeah. Yes. All right. That's it. I'm telling you, I'm telling you, it's going <laughs> way back. Todavía pagaba con colones when I started working. Okay. They told me, you know what the, you know what the, the funniest thing was when I saw my contract for the first time and they told me the amount in colones, I was, I almost fainted because it was just so many colones. <laughs> I, I couldn't imagine, you know, it was, it was just amazing. Yeah. All right. So my name, Roberto Martinez, 15 years, you know, helping out. I, uh, the company that I worked for, you know, the longest was, you know, Converges, which was actually a couple of different companies. Um, I have a friend that works with Insaforp and Inglés Corporativo. 
I told him, well, he asked me one day, he said, have you ever thought about teaching? And I said, well, I, I, I am, you know, I'm a teacher, but I, I do it here. He says, have you thought about working outside of the call center industry? And, you know, I, I actually thought about it. I learned, I took a few classes with Insaforp and I really, really liked it. And so now I am here and I am a teacher with Inglés Corporativo con Insaforp. Así es que that's what I'm doing now. A ver, le voy a poner, this is what I'm doing now. Now. There you go. And my English. Well, my English, I have learned my English through a lot of practice. Uh, I've gone to a lot of academies. Uh, Centro Cultural. Uh, I've gone through private classes. But you know what really helped me the most? Can, can anybody guess what really helped me the most when it came to learning English? Maybe music. Oh, you know, that one helps a lot too. Yes, music. Practice, nice. There we go. Practice. <clears throat> Watching movies. Watching movies and Only somebody's... Learning English. There we go. Practice, watching movies, reading books, talking to my friends. So I'm going to put practice with friends. Now, my friends are a little bit different than most friends. Nowadays, one of your friends will laugh at you and make fun of you because your English is a little bad. My <laughs> friends didn't work that way. My friends, what they did is they would tell me, you're saying it wrong. This is how you say it. And that is the best way to learn. Somebody that knows a little bit more English tells you this is how you say it right. And so mm -hmm. I want us to kind of keep that in mind because that's the way we're going to work, right? Whenever you guys say something and maybe the pronunciation is a little bit off, we're going to work on that pronunciation and we're going to do it as a class. Así es que be prepared for that. All right. So practice with friends. Everybody here, we are friends. And so that means that we're going to get a whole lot of practice. So who likes practice? How many of you guys like to practice? Nice. Nice. It. Excellent. Excellent. All right. Remember, practice makes better. Practice makes better. Yeah. So we're going to start off and you guys see how I talked a little bit about myself. We're going to make it easy for you guys. We're going to do a presentation as well. Hi, my name is Roberto Martinez. And we're going to start off with name. I want you guys to talk to me about your work experience. Uh, actually, you know what? We're going to talk about I want to say, I, I know that it could be, I've worked at a lot of places. So if you ask me about work experience, we're going to be here all night. Um, how about your last or your current? Vamos a ponerle así. Last or current work experience. That's how we're going to put it. There we go. I want to know about your English skills. Where did you start to learn English? I want to know a little bit about you. So I want to know if you have a hobby. I, I haven't mentioned my hobby yet, right? And I, I, I want to ask you guys about things, one thing that you like and one thing that you don't like. Y esto puede ser de cualquier cosa. Ah, es que fui, ¿verdad? A un lugar donde sirven solo bebidas alcohólicas y pues a mí no me gusta, ¿verdad? So you guys can say things like that. And it could be anything, it could be general. So now I'm missing, right? I'm missing my hobby. One of my hobbies is to, actually you guys are going to be surprised, 
I, I have the little cactus. You guys, you have you guys seen the little cactus? Yeah. The little miniature cactus que se ponen en la oficina. Yeah. Little little yeah. cactus, miniature cactus. So what I do is I, I get those and I and I and I plant them and then I sell them. You know, I, I yeah, you know, hey, hey, it's it's my hobby. I love little cactuses. Uh things that I like. I like, believe it or not, I like to ride the bus. I like to ride La, por ejemplo, por ejemplo, la 101D, because it is a really long <laughs> drive. I really like it. I really like that. What I don't like, I don't like it when the bus is too that's filled it. with people. So if everybody's sitting down, then that's okay. Pero, <laughs> but when it gets really, really filled, I get, I get like an attack. So I don't like like crowded places. All right, yes. all right, all right. For those of you that are joining or are, that joined a little bit uh, after we had started, hello, uh, Fabiola, welcome. Beatriz, hello. Well, hello. Hello, hello. Beatriz, hola, que tal? Vanessa, hola, bienvenidas, welcome to class. My name is Roberto Martinez. I also put it in the chat. So if you guys have access to your chats, you guys will see that we have been writing a, a, a lot of things. So we stay busy with the chat as well. Okay, there is a, a few things that I would like to touch up on before we get started. And I want you guys to imagine that here or in this class, we all know each other very well and that we are all really, really friendly. Todos somos amigos, todos somos compadres y comadres. And so the idea is for you guys to feel comfort comfortable. I want you guys to feel safe in an environment that you guys can share. Because remember that if you share, you get practice. And if you practice, you get what? Once you practice, the more you practice, you get Better. There better. we go. There we go. The more practice, the better you get. All right. So this is the only time that I'm going to go one by one, um, not because of any specific way, but it's just the way that you guys come up on my screen. So I have Luis Enrique. Welcome. Welcome, Luis. I, I, think, I, I think you just popped into my screen. Luis Enrique. And what I'm, gonna, what I'm going to ask you to do, Max, hello, hello. I see you on there, Max. What I'm going to ask you guys to do is to answer some of these questions. For example, what is your name? What is your last? My name is. Oh, okay. Hold on, hold please. Hold on, hold on. You got it. That's it. That's the spirit, brother. That's the spirit. <laughs> the name, okay. your last or current work experience. Where did you start to learn English? Hobbies, one thing you like and one thing that you don't like. Okay, Luis, are you ready? Yes, I'm ready. Fantastic, let's go, Luis. Okay. Um, hello, my name is Luis Enrique Majano. It's a pleasure to me chatting with you today. Um, my last work experience was in a bank. I have been working for Banco Haite Continental El Salvador for, for eight years. Um, nowadays, I have, um, I have my own business. About the hobby, about the hobby that I have, I really like it to uh, go to the gym every day. Not every day, but from Monday to Friday, I I try to try to go. Um, about one thing I like, uh, I like so much go to the beach at at least unless uh, once a once a month. And one thing I don't like it is uh, when 
when the people is uh, is really is really a hypocrisy. Now, I don't know if it's correct uh, that word, teacher. Hypocrite. Okay, you can say when people are hypocrites. Yes, hypocrite. Yes. There we go. You I got really, it. You got I it. Really dis I, I really dislike. All right. Okay. Okay. I, I think that's and, it, right? You don't like hypocrisy. There we go. That's the way. Yeah. So you don't okay. like hypocrisy and you don't like people to be hypocrites. También. You can also say it like that. Yes, yes, yes. That's right. All right. Well, thank you very much. Please welcome uh, aboard. Yes, sir. I, I, for, I, I think I forgot the, uh, the place that I started to learn English. I okay. started to learn English many, many, many years ago at, at IFCA. At IFCA. Okay. Yes. Nice. Okay. That's all, all right. right. Thank you very much, please. Thank you very much and welcome aboard. Thank you. All right. You. Thank you. Right next to me, I have Max. Max, my friend, you ready for this? Yeah. Let's do it. Okay. My name is Max Mendes. Uh, actually, my name is Maximiliano, but for sure, Max. Max. Uh, let me see what, what are the topics I'm going to cover. Okay. My, my last uh, work experience was uh, in sales. Okay. Uh, my current, um, actually, um, nowadays I'm working in Mexicano City Hall. Uh, I, I started to learn English uh, 10 years ago at the University of El Salvador. Um, I love music, I love video games, I love movies, uh, but talking about music, I just like, uh, I mean, I'm not into reggaeton, bachata, yeah. and those kind of music. I, ha I, I really hate them. A poner bichota iba, fíjate, Max. No. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. You got it. Well, thank you very much. Max, thank you very much. Well, thank you and welcome aboard. Um, the screen keeps moving around, so I'm going to go with Daniela. Daniela Guevara? Daniela. Hola, Daniela. Hello, good night. Hello. Okay. Um, my name is Daniela Guevara. My last work experience was like was in human resource assistant was my first job and I started to learn English in the school and for my own. I went to ITCA too for one year and a half and my hobby is watch movies. I like dogs, I like cats. Uh, I don't like vegetables. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> But All right. When I I don't like when they are cook. Okay. You don't and like them cook, but you like them raw. Yeah. Okay. All right. We got it. Well, thank you very much, Daniela. Thank you very much. Welcome aboard. Welcome aboard. All right. Moving. Ninive. It is your turn. <laughs> <laughs> My name is Nino Hernandez. I work, um, I, I work in Tento with Telefonica uh, from two, three to Actually, mm -hmm. I work with Excel. Okay. 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 All right. <laughs> you hear me? <laughs> I, well, you know, we heard a little bit from time to time. I heard, lo que le pude escuchar was, le quiero dar mucho dinero al teacher. Esa fue una de las cosas. Eh, I think <laughs> I, I, I heard, le voy a dar el carro al teacher. Ni nivel, no se preocupe. We got you. Ah, la, per we, we, la perdimos, la perdimos. Sí, se nos fue. Okay. 
Ya va a regresar. Ya va. Ahí está, ahí está, Nive. We thought we lost you. Okay. We got you, we got you. Thank you very much. Welcome aboard. I'm sorry. It's okay. No worries. Thank no worries. You. Okay. Okay, it moved around a little bit, so we're gonna. So it, actually, now okay. we have Jose. Hello, everyone. Hello. My name is Jose Gonzalo Mejia. I am from Zulutan. Um, my last ex work experience was in a tire shop. I was in customer service. Um, I have three years that I, I don't work under. Um, my hobby, I like to read many books. I like to learn new things. I don't like the noisy places. Um, I start to learn English from when I have uh, eight years old, when my, co my cousin came to El Salvador and I heard her to speak in English. Um, my desire for learning is start and I was learning by myself. Okay, all right. Yeah. Well, well, welcome aboard, Jose. Now you don't have to do it by yourself. We're here, right? Okay. Thank and you. we'll be more than happy to talk to you. Okay. All right. Thank you. All right. We have Josue. Josue, pase adelante, amigo. Josue. Hello, everyone. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Well, my name is Josue Perez. People call me Josh. My last experience was working as an investment advisor in a housing project named Ciudad Marsella. Oh. I was working, yeah, I was working there from one year, but now I'm in a training for working for another company. And I learned English at European Academy three years ago, but I like to learn new things every day because I know that English is many things that I can learn and I like to spend time watching videos to, to improve my grammar, my speaking. And something that I don't like is the traffic. I really hate that. <laughs> but that's all I can tell you about me. All right. Well, that, that's enough. That's enough, Jose. Thank you very much. Welcome aboard. All right. We have Dennis. Pass the land to Dennis. All right. Uh, good evening. My name is Dennis Calderon. Hello, sir. I'm missing the R in my name. I'm seeing right now, but my first uh, work, well, my last work experience was as a customer service at, at uh, Telefonica store. Then I start my English career in ninth, ninth grade when I just remember the verb to be classes and okay. I just like that. And one of my hobby is try to to run or jogging every weekend. And it is something that I like. Okay. Run. And something that I dislike is, let me see, uh, what? Oh, it's about Paris. Uh, that's, that's what you don't like? Yeah. Okay. All right. Mm -hmm. Okay. We'll take it. We'll take it. Okay. Now, for a minute, I thought, tal vez el Denny, tal vez le gusta así como Tego Calderón, pero tal vez no, no le gusta esa fama. <laughs> Entonces se quitó la R para no tener ese problema. Caldeón. Caldeón. <laughs> All right. Well, welcome, welcome, Dennis. All right, David, pasa adelante, amigo. Okay. Uh, my name is David Rivas. I, I have worked at Avianca for 10 years. And I started to English in the school. Uh, after that, I studied English at UCA for 10 months. And I, I like to watch movies with my wife and daughter. And I like to read books. And I don't like 
to wash the dishes, but my wife assigned me this task. Only no. that, that nice, David. So you have a list of things to do, and you know you have the dishes that you have to do. <laughs> yes, that's good, though, David. That's good. That's good. Teamwork, teamwork, sir. All right, we're moving on down. Uh, we're gonna go to Jorge Luis. Jorge, hacia adelante, Jorge. Okay, hello, good evening, everybody. Hello, good evening, sir. My name is Jorge Luis Mendoza. I am 44 years old. And about my current work or experience, uh, my team is uh, responsible to training when my company had a new hires. Okay, all right. Uh, I have been training people uh, around three years ago. And when I started my a Korea English. In 2001, I remember I studied English in at UCA. After that, I studied in different places, is, such as a uh, Universidad Santa Ana Unicans. Okay. Uh, after that, I traveled to the Santa Ana too, and I studied. I was studying English at English for a call center, English for CC. E for CC, okay. E for CC, and once. Once, uh, once my hobby or once my hobby is I work my computer because when I while I was working in my computer, I spent a lot of time okay. until I went to my bed. All right. Uh, okay. One thing I like is uh, I drink some coffee with a sweet bread. <laughs> what things I don't like is a uh, sopa maruchan. So, no, some of my channel is so good. No. All right. No. 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 Oh, so delicious, Jorge. All right. Well, yeah. no, for me. Welcome, okay, welcome. That, welcome okay, aboard. Okay. <laughs> Thank you, Jorge. All right. We're going to go uh, Rafael, Rafael Monge. Hi. Everyone. Hello. Hello, Raf. Uh, <laughs> okay. My name is Rafael Antonio Monge Toledo. I live in Salco City. And uh, well, I've been working during this year uh, as a math teacher. I studied mathematics in the University of, of Sonsonate. And so I've been working um, as a math teacher during the last year. Um, well, my, I, I remember that I started out uh, studying English in the European Academy once years ago. Um, then I decided to sign up to E4CC and I've been studying there uh, for one month, if I'm not mistaken. And let me check another question. Well, one of my, ho my hobbies are playing soccer and playing piano. Those are things that I love the most because I think they relax me a lot. And on the other hand, I could say that um, one thing that I don't like is, for example, when I'm working in team and my team doesn't want to work uh, hard because I've always considered myself like a hardworking person and I don't like when when they don't want to work maybe the same way and I'm not I'm not saying that uh, it, it is bad um, playing or making jokes sometimes right but but I think we have to put the, the things in, in in their place sometimes and and well that is something that I don't like <laughs> All right, we'll accept it. Yeah. There's, a, there's a time and a place for everything. All right. Thank you very much, Rafael, and welcome aboard. If I have issues with math, I know exactly where to go, sir. I know exactly where to go. <laughs> okay, sure. <laughs> All right. Okay, pasamos. Iris, hello, Iris. Pase adelante, Iris. Hi. Hi. Um, good evening, everybody. Uh, good evening. My name is Iris Sanchez. I have my own business. I want to start to study English in English uh, Corporativo in 2019. Okay. And one, one thing I like is go out with my friends and take a coffee and pass. Okay. Hello, hello. Uh, to what? 
No está encendido. Well, we don't have teacher anymore. Lo siento, lo siento. <laughs> don't worry. Me acaba de ¿Cómo es? I, I'm not sure it, it, it's me or it's you. I, I <laughs> you know, you froze, and then I, and then I started looking, and I was like, I think Iris lost her internet, and then I noticed that everybody else stopped moving. <laughs> And I, like, oh God, and I was like, oh my God, it's me. I'm the one with, oh my God, Iris, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Oh, geez. Okay. Right, right. Okay, Iris, uh, let me see. Did, did you cover everything? The hobby? Uh, uh, the hobby, I, I like um, go to the gym. Okay. I love doing spinning. This okay. This is my hobby. Spinning. The spinning is, is the bike, right? Yeah, indoor. Okay. Okay. Cycling indoor. Okay. Uh, one thing that you like? I like go out with my friends. Okay. Pass the time. Yeah. Nice. This is the things I prefer. Okay. One thing that you don't like? Recently, I discovered I don't like um, fishing. Oh, okay. Like yeah. going out on a boat and... Yeah. Okay. All right. <laughs> Recently, a friend invited me and I never go in for that. And, and I discovered, oh, wow, it's boring for me. Right. I yeah. <laughs> I you wait know. and wait. And, wait. <laughs> and nothing. And, and that's what happened. I, I, I completely understand the feeling, Iris. All right. Welcome. Welcome aboard. Thank you so much. Okay. And then so it switched over a little bit. And I want to see uh, here, Beatriz. Beatriz, you haven't, you haven't had a chance, right? Hi. Good evening, Hi. Everyone. Hi. Good evening. Um, well, my name is Beatriz Alegria. Mm. I'm working in the International Airport of El Salvador. I'm air traffic controller. And... I was a start to learn English in San U.S. in the University of El Salvador um, okay. seven years ago, I think. I don't remember very well. And my hobby is listening to music and read some books about the history. And I like to discover beautiful places in, in our country with my friends and camping. And I don't like the hot weather. Okay. Yeah. Hot weather is an issue here. Hot weather is an issue, Bam. Okay. Would you like for us to call you Beatriz, Beatriz, or Bea? What do you prefer? Um, Beatriz or Bea, it's, it's good for me. Okay. Excellent. Yeah. Excellent. Gracias, Beatriz. Beatriz. Okay. All right. Let me see. It moved around a little bit. So I think Vanessa. A ver, Vanessa, Vanessa, por favor, pase adelante. <laughs> Good evening. Uh, Hello. My name is Vanessa Pastor. Uh, my current job is in Tigo. I am in the payment department. So it's a little stressful. <laughs> um, well, one of the things that I don't like is like, I don't like to read. Uh, I don't know why, but it, I feel, I don't know, maybe it's because I don't, I didn't find a, a, a interest book, maybe. Okay. So All I right. prefer to watch a movie. That's like, I like the most, watch a movie or because I like to stay in my house. I don't like to go out so much. So I prefer to stay uh, in my house, watching a movie or a series, whatever. So that's all I can say. Okay. All right. We will accept that. Vanessa, thank you so much. Welcome. <laughs> thank you. Fabiola. Hello. Hello. My name is Fabiola. Um, I work in a construction company, but not in building builds. I oh. work in administration positions. Okay. I like to cook desserts 
and eat them. I don't like um, wake up early because I am not a morning person. Okay. My hobby is um, play table games. And I start to learn in English a long, long time ago okay. <laughs> in a few academies, but I still don't learn the language completely, only a little bit. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, you know, it, like I was, I, I was mentioning to the class that I have been working with call centers for 15 years. And even though my English is, is, I would say that it, I, I can definitely have a conversation. It still needs work. So it's something that takes a long time, a lot of practice. Fabiola, don't right, not for one second, uh, stop and say, no, this is too hard. It is, it's not, you, you know, the more you do it, the more you do it, the better you get at it. And then someday, someday, van a decir, ¿y esa gringa quién es? No, hombre, no es una gringa, la Fabiola. ¿va? Y eso es lo que nosotros andamos buscando at the end. So, <laughs> so keep your, keep, you know, you. keep working, keep working. All right, I, I'm thinking, let me see, am I missing anybody? And it, it all moved around on me. So now I don't know, I'm not, I'm not sure if we managed to cover everybody. Is there somebody that has not presented themselves? Did I miss anybody? No? Everybody good? Okay, okay. Yeah, me. A ver, Juan Manuel. Yeah. Pase adelante, por favor, amigo. Okay, thank you. Uh, my name is Juan Manuel Portillo. Uh, my friends call me Manuel. Uh, my, la my last work experience was in a food company that export to the United States. You okay. know, nostalgic food. Okay. Like tamales, horchata, and that kind of food. Ooh. And, and yeah, I work in the quality control department uh, with the international standardization uh, ISO. Okay. 9001. Yeah. My hobby, uh, probably cooking. My mom teach me a lot. To cook. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, one thing I like is to eat Mexican food and watch the sunsets. And so, one thing I don't like. Juan Manuel, yeah. so do you cook your own tacos? That's the question here. No, tacos, no. No? <laughs> Only <laughs> tortas. Oh, all right, all right. Now that, that, that we're talking, all right, yeah. We, we, all right, I'm sorry, Juan. I'm sorry, I Juan. I make tacos. Yeah. Okay. No se me da. <laughs> yeah. All right. All right. There and you go. The, one thing I don't like is the, when people smoke near me because that's produced me a heritage. Or right. when people burn leaves, you know? Okay. That kind of smoke makes me a heritage. Yeah. yeah. It's, it, it's pretty annoying. I, I'm with you on that one. Um, mi abuelita me regaló así un gran montón de marihuana para echarle a, al alcohol y dije yo no lo voy a sacar y lo voy a quemar pero me dio un dolor de cabeza te entiendo Juan te entiendo All right uh, is that it Juan Juan was that no no es no es el último uh, Jorge 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 pasó sí verdad sí pasó Jorge sí okay uh, anybody missing anybody missing Okay, something that caught my attention, right? I, I see a fantastic class. But uh, Jorge, Jorge, did you say that you were 44 years old or 24 years old? 44 years old. Uh, Jorge, let me tell you that you look really young. And looking at you, you saying that you're 44, I, I would say no, because you look really young, my friend. So, so okay, thank you. Good, good for you. I, I'm thinking that you sleep well, you know, and, and that's how you keep like that. Vas a durar como hasta los 120 y todavía te vas a ver así bien, bien joven. Así que, good, good for you. Um, con Bea, Bea, air traffic controller, let me tell you that this is the first time that I meet somebody <laughs> yeah. that tells me I'm an air traffic controller. So, so for me, it's something that I'm going to, I'm going to, lo voy a poner en una plaquita y, y con, con así, Bea, y le voy a poner así como una cosita, air traffic controller. All right. Um, con, 
Con, con Raf, Rafael, algo que me llamó mucho la atención, mathematicians. Um, we do, we have mathematicians, but usually, you know, you don't see them that often. Uh, to tell you the truth, you, you are also one of the first persons that says, hey, you know what? I love mathematics to the point that I want to teach somebody else. And it sounds to me like you really enjoy what you do. So, so congratulations on that. Um, aparte de eso, everybody, everybody, please keep in mind that the class is for all of us to feel good and to try to participate as much as possible. I have role plays for you where we are going to interact a conversation and we're going to work on pronunciation. Uh, remember that that's pretty much what, what I like to do the most. Um, with conversation comes a lot of grammar. So before we talk about something specific, I am going to talk to you guys about grammar and the theory behind grammar and how it works. Once we look at the theory, we're going to start to put it into practice and we're going to practice and practice until we get really, really good with that. Okay. Um, before we go anywhere else, I want to finish day number one, which is only the introduction. I want to talk to you guys about the platform. How many of you guys already know the platform really, really well? Can you raise your hand if you if you guys have been working on the platform that we use and you guys already you guys are pretty good with it. OK. All right. OK. How many of you guys. Is this the first time that you guys have gone into uh, one of the virtual classes and this is going to be the first time that you use the platform uh, for corporate English? Anybody here the first time? First time, Joe, Jose? Okay. All right, Jose and then the team, we have some changes. I don't know if you guys have had the chance to go into the platform today or throughout the week. Let me go ahead and share that with you guys. And so there has been some changes. Uh, here's my screen. Let me go ahead and move some of this stuff around. Okay. And here it is. Let me move this and here. Okay. All right. So it has changed because the way we had it before, the way we have seen the platform before, the way I had it set up, I was able to see pretty much all the modules and then I could choose from the different modules. And what has happened is that now when you go into your module and the section, I can only see this. Is this the same for you guys? Yes, it's the same teacher. It's the same, okay. So yes. one of the key differences is that now, in order for you to get the sections, you have to click on it. And then once you click on it, you are gonna come into the modules and you have, you're going to have to go one by one. So for example, I am gonna click previous and I'm gonna start in the intro video, which is the section one video. And then, so from here, as you guys know, you guys watch the video and then you click next. And as you're moving along, you guys are gonna get the green circle with the white check mark, and then you complete the module that way. You can always go back to the course, however, you can't see the sections one by one anymore. Do you guys have any questions? We're good? Okay. I have a question. Uh, question, question? Yes. Yes, I, um, when I, I get into the platform and the section one, and I see the first video, is necessary to uh, put a, a comment or not? You know, it is not mandatory. However, some of the videos will ask you to go and put down something here. 
my recommendation yeah. my recommendation is for you to try it and see how it works out for you now you don't get negative feedback you don't get uh, judgmental uh well nobody judges what you write because um it, it doesn't say who wrote it uh, so for practice purposes i recommend that you use it but teacher y a la fuerza lo tengo que hacer no a la fuerza ni los zapatos verdad entonces <laughs> you guys my recommendation go ahead and try it for practice if you feel like doing it okay Yes. Same thing, same thing for the class. Yeah. Same thing for the class. Remember, we have, I, I only have like one rule for the class. My one rule is only to participate. That's it. Everything else, I, I think you guys have heard it before, right? And so when I ask you to participate, it's not because I like you or dislike you. Uh, when I ask you to participate is for the sole purpose of us getting better at what we do, right? And and let me tell you that when I talk, like if I talk for so long, my throat starts to hurt. So that's when you guys come in and you guys get to save my life, right? So you guys get to practice as well. All right. So okay. to check your progress, right? If you want to check your progress, because you guys are going through the sections, but the green check marks are, are there and they're not there and you're not sure, you can go into progress. And here, once you click on it, there's going to be like a little progress tracker where you can see all the sections and it tells you how well you're doing. Now, teacher, can I go ahead and complete as much of this as possible? Yes. Go ahead and complete as much of it as possible. The more, the merrier. Now, where do we come in as a class? I go in through one of the sections and we're going to cover the most important pieces of those sections. So for example, as you guys see the introduction video, well, there's a video, there's really not that much for us to cover besides what you hear, right? So listening exercises might be something that we incorporate into what we do in class. And then we start with the lessons. And then the first one we look at is, I was really immature. And this one goes back to listening or listening exercises. We move ahead. And time clauses. So now this is going to be a, an important portion of what we cover in class because it's going to be where? Where do you guys think it's going to be? If it's important, where do you guys think you guys will see it again? Where will you see questions regarding time clauses? No, no, anybody? Well, you're gonna see questions in the knowledge check, but but if you guys go back into the course, you guys are gonna notice that we have midterms and we have final exams. You guys see it over here? Yeah. All right, so all of those questions that we saw in the previous sections or the most important sections or the most important modules well, these usually come back around in the midterm and in the final exam. And so what we're gonna do is we're gonna focus on those during class. If you guys have questions, if you guys are really ahead, but you still have questions about, uh, you know, sections that you covered uh, previously, we can answer them. If you are really ahead and you cover something that we haven't seen yet, we can cover it more towards the end of the class. We're going to cover all the important material at the very beginning, and then we're going to cover the questions at the end. All right? Okay. Do you guys have any questions about the platform? I have one. Yes, sir. Uh, for example, I remember that in the last, in the last uh, course, I remember that there were certain uh, mistakes in the platform because yes. when we wanted to to 
well, do the exercises that there were that there were there. I remember that we couldn't. So my question is if we uh, can ask you through the WhatsApp group. Oh, of course, yes, yes. Um, I was going to tell you guys that um, we have the web page and we have an app. The app. Uh, sometimes it gives more problems than the web page, but the web page also gives problems. So my recommendation is when you're using the app or the web page, if you're in, if you encounter problems, close the application, close the website, uh, restart it again, and if you still get the problem, please reach out to us in our WhatsApp uh, group. Also, the WhatsApp is also for our class. So I recommend for you guys to ask questions, uh, to share information. Um, if somebody in the group asks a question and you know the answer, please feel free to answer or send a screenshot. Uh, we also accept uh, memes. Actually, memes in English is pronounced memes. So from now on, whenever you guys want to discuss about memes, remember, it's meme. And yes, they are welcome in the group. Siempre y cuando, verdad, tenga, eh, sean friendly to everybody. So, uh, no vayan a poner nada ahí todo dark. And <laughs> <laughs> all right. Okay. So, we're all set for day one. Today was just about the introduction for us to know each other, for you guys to know your teacher, the master del universo, verdad? Eh, for us to have a small chat, small conversation, and to quickly review the platform. Um, I'm going to join in the WhatsApp group, and I'm going to say hello to everybody. And if you guys have questions there, you guys can also reach me through WhatsApp. Yo no duermo. Eh, paso despierto noche y día. Así es que si algún día se levantan o están despiertos a las 2, 3 de la mañana y quieren hablar con su teacher, aquí estoy, ah, con mucho gusto. <laughs> Así es que con eso, ladies and gentlemen, me despido de ustedes esta noche. Hope to see you guys tomorrow again. And you guys are always and will always be welcome to class. Uh, that's pretty much it. Sayonara, everybody. Have a great night. Good night. And see you guys tomorrow. Good night. Bye, everybody. Bye, everyone. Bye, Bye. teacher. See you tomorrow. Thank you. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night.